Already Island boys they beefing. They speak on my name. I'm exposing. I'm dropping everything. I'm speaking on everything I know. I know some weird, weird, weird stuff. Deep, weird stuff. I'm speaking on it. I'm just saying. Do not associate me with Island Boys Entertainment right now. They're sick. They, they, they're sick folks. I'm not a puppet, so they sick. They're sick. Like you feel me? Don't even speak on me. I don't make no diss song about me, no nothing. They keeping in the street, cause they know what type of time I be on. For real. And I ain't real about nobody. All right, let me just get this out the way real quick. These new face tattoos that the Island Boys got look really bad. They're slowly turning into Lil Pyru. It's too much. Okay, so recently I've been rooting against the Island Boys, not just because I heard a lot of negative things about them. I don't need to hear people talk about them. They do a good enough job embarrassing themselves. I mean, forget about me. They burn bridges with the actual famous people like Ray J, Logan Paul, Adam22, their former manager Poker, who I'll make a video about real soon but the most famous person, of course, being Ghost World. Now don't get the wrong idea. I'm not gonna cheer if somebody fails. The Island Boys made a business move right. They allowed somebody to pay them a few thousand dollars to live with them and to be a part of the Island Boys, quote unquote. The person who paid them was VM. The Island Boys have always had a contentious relationship with them. Oh, mama, what the fuck is you talking about? He pays me to be his fucking friend. I ain't got a cop out none. Look, listen. I don't give a fuck. You can think I'm broke. I just know how to get to it. I don't give a fuck about that. That's it, bro. He, he, he called me. Look, fight who? Y'all trying to fight him? The, the little f with the bucket hat? Y'all trying to fight? Oh, he's I, square, bro. He's square. Bro. He's square. He's square. Bro, he's a lame. He's sure. Nobody cares about him. He wants our clout. Say, he's a clout chaser. <laughs> who really got clout? Be real. Me, the twins, or you? Hey, you Yo, you see that? They just called him a square and that they were just using him for his money. And people don't change. There was another instance where they were playing the wheel game and VM actually stole $50 from Red. At the time, Red was only making $200 a day. And VM is a guy who falsely claims to make $10,000 a day. I've made about two million dollars independently. Yeah. Yo, I'm in South Carolina right now. I am a Mer I'm a Mer Myrtle Beach. Yo, view. I'm at Myrtle Beach. I'll send you my address and everything. Come. I'm going to be here for the next four days. View, come here. I will beat the fuck out of you. But he really needs this 50 bucks. So the Island Boys ended up blowing up to a mainstream level. And this guy, VM, he wants to be a rapper. Real bad. He's tried everything. Premiering his video on No Jumper. Getting a Peso Peso feature. And not to hurt your feelings, but you can get a Drake feature and people still won't mess with you. Let me talk to Satan, white girl off of Xanax. I can make you famous. Let me talk to Satan. We gon' get high in the spaceship. She a white girl with them Kylie Jenner lips. I could probably give Kim K another kid. I'm a trap star, so let me talk my shit. I'm a rock star, you gon' take the charge. This fool can't write lyrics, he just repeats the same five words. I mean, there are parrots who have bigger vocabularies, actually. He couldn't find a word that rhymed with piccolo. I feel like piccolo, sipping on his green. Piccolo, get it though, video, Arsenio. I mean, come on, bro. If you're gonna rap, you gotta rhyme. Just like if you're gonna play basketball, you gotta dribble. You can't just run with it like a football. It's not changing the rules, it's just common sense. He can't sing either, not a melodic dude. How do you expect to make it as a rapper when you're not musically talented? There are plenty of good rappers that go unnoticed. Guero 10K, Cash Out Ace, Drip Lee. What makes you think you're gonna make it when you're below average? I wouldn't try to play hockey if I didn't know how to ice skate. This guy VM, he can't rap but he wants to be a rapper. Why? Well, I guess he's attracted to the lifestyle. He thinks if he becomes a rapper, it'll be easy money, easy women. See, he wasn't cool growing up, so he wants to be cool now. Again, spending tens of thousands of dollars just to get a couple thousand views. I'd invest my money somewhere else. There's other ways to get rich besides being a rapper. This fool sells his car, moves out of California to Florida to live with the Island Boys. Red and Fly, you gotta tell us how much he paid you exactly. When he joins them, there's immediate problems. 
He gets caught flirting with underage transgender women. They go to Hawaii and get kicked out after a day because Tarzan likes harassing teenagers. And just recently, he was trying to flirt with 16 year olds on TikTok. On Instagram right now is Vum6K. Follow me on IG. Hey, shorty in the back. DM. No. Follow me right now. The girl in the back. No. Follow me right no, now. No, she's not going to follow you. Pass her the she phone. No, no. Pass her no, the phone. I'm no. on the same shit. She like 13. I don't know. What the fuck? I was 13 like three years ago. And let's not forget, he showed his dick to a 12 year old boy. The worst thing about him, though, is that he's not a fan of famous criminals. Taking like these lame ass YouTube videos about me. God bless this poor bastard. He gave the Island Boys money so he can live with them. Then I guess he ran out, so they kicked him out. I guess he was expecting them to still like him when he wasn't paying them. VM is the type of guy to get a prostitute and then get angry that she didn't call him the next day for round two. It's business. They don't actually like you. They just want your money. So he ended up moving back in with his family. I thought you made 10 grand a day. You're in a trailer park. I mean, what a humble guy. He claims to be a millionaire, yet he's sleeping in a den with his two dogs. This is really the saddest thing I've ever seen. Those poor dogs, they gotta deal with VM all day. You know how dogs have better hearing compared to humans? Whenever VM raps, I wish I didn't have ears. So you know those poor pups are suffering. I also feel bad for his family. They got a pedophilic burden of a son who thinks he's gonna make it in the music industry. But whatever your dream is, don't give up on it. You gotta know what your limitations are sometimes. I get in return, it's bro, we don't rock with you no more. Literally, that's it, we don't rock with you. Like, it's all good vibes, like da 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 da, we just don't, yeah, peace. I'm like, what? Okay, for sure. You think I trip? You think I'm gonna be like, ah, begging? No, boy, I'm a, I'm a whole grown man, dude. Come on now. I'm not low, so I'm not a little dirty kid from the hood that needs a handout. <laughs> so come on now. I kept saying it was gonna be the next Beatles, now it is what it is. Y'all Did he just say the Beatles? Bro, y'all ain't even on the same level as the Rudels. That's pure delusion. You can't even move 750 copies when your grandma buys half of them. How are you gonna compare yourself to a band that sold 750 million? Oh. Keep playing like that, Blackie. You know what I'm on, boy. Keep doing that, Los. Ain't nobody make me get nothing. And if 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 y'all gonna start playing like that, Blackie, I'm gonna start exposing my boy. You heard me? I'm gonna start telling Nick what, what you want, cause you know you're a homo, bro. You know you like guys. You be acting way too happy. You know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna say the word. You act too happy. And now that he's been kicked out, he's accusing Blackie of being gay. First of all, he seems to like women. Second off. I don't care if he's gay, that's not something an intelligent person uses against somebody else. Homophobia is stupid. Third off, VM, you showed your dick to a boy. You told a teenage boy that you loved him, and you were caught flirting with transgender teenagers. I don't care if you're bisexual, it's the pedophilic stuff that's more concerning. That's NFT, that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, really can ambush the whole joint. I'm not. Yeah, everybody got the drop, but I know the ins and outs. I know how to get in that joint safely. I know how to get up out that joint safely. Like, I, I, bro, I'm a very dangerous person, bro. It's like this when the CA trained Osama bin Laden and then they switched on him. No, bro. You don't switch on somebody I know too much about you, gang. It is what it is. Don't associate me with that group. I'm, we're, we're just, we separated. I pretty much got betrayed, snaked out. I don't even know what, what, what their whole reasoning is. It is what it is. So he starts off saying, I know how to break into the Island Boys residence. Then he follows it with, we're separated, we're broken up. I mean, bro, were you banging them? You seem a little heartbroken. That's kind of gangster. They had you get the forehead tattoo and then they kicked you out. Detective, I know how to, <coughs> I know how to get on the property without even going through the gates. <coughs> I know how to ambush the whole area. And he's threatening to ambush them, and he's even comparing himself to Osama bin Laden, his hero. If y'all still support me, I'm just saying I'm not part of that group anymore. Um, they're very negative folks, to be honest, now that I think about it. I'm nothing but loyal. When we went to Hawaii, I stepped on everybody. I was helping them out. Bop, 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 front line. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Los, they puppet. I'm not no puppet. That's why they realize I'm not a puppet. <laughs> Probably mad that I'm not no little puppet. Now don't get it fucked up. 
He's not a puppet just because he likes it when hands go inside him. That doesn't mean you control his thoughts. Anyway, good move by the island boys. Kicking this dude out was a good decision. As for VM, you may have gotten kicked out by the island boys, but there's still hope. You can join the Edgar twins. Give them $5,000, but before you do that, please consider buying a famous criminal's towel. It's got the mountains, skyline, rainbow, gold. I can't wait to go to the pool with this towel and the sandals to match. And before you buy this merch, be cautious. You might end up getting somebody pregnant. Work on your pullout game. The mug too, man. You don't have to fill it up with coffee. You could put straight up tequila in it. You still look sophisticated holding it. Anyway, I'm out. That nigga's a lame. Bro, nigga, you sent me over $3,000. Just so you could get a little bit of clout. Bro, you're a lame, bro. You got my fans. I work for this. You don't have to work for shit. You pay for it, you fuck nigga. You're a weirdo. Cornball, your girlfriend don't even like you. She don't even come from you. Your girlfriend don't even come from you. That ugly ass white dykey LGBT fucking bitch. That ugly snobby snotty ugly bitch that y'all gonna make ugly kids with. You look like a fucking Mexican chinky nerd. You fucking sherm. You don't look on that at all. You look like a whole bitch. You look such like a bitch that you look like a bitch next to your fucking peso peso. You didn't even talk to me like that in real life. You're scared of me and my brother. Y'all some Florida slimy niggas. You have no type of lingo.